Welcome to Knick Knacks Corner. Today, I'm going to talk to you about Mapping the Interior by Stephen Graham Jones. Um, it's only a hundred page book, well just a little bit over, uh, so it didn't take very long to read. I was throwing a couple little books at the end of the month here just so I could um, read a couple extra things I've been wanting to get to, and I was so happy to get to this book. Uh, Stephen Graham Jones uh, wrote one of my favorite books of 2020, which was The Only Good Indians, and I absolutely loved it. This book here, um, I would say is around the same quality, but not as much as I loved uh, The Only Good Indians. This one is a ghost story. Um, I don't really want to give it all away because it's very short and it's hard to really let you know what it is without giving it all up. Um, I'll just let you know that it's like very sweet, very disturbing, very uh, emotional. There's a lot of stuff going on in here, a lot to unpack. There is um, some joy, some sadness. Um, there's a lot of um, talking of broken families and things like that within the story and I just found it was a very sweet book. Uh, for being horror, it had a very nice uh, emotional tone to it that I thought was just fantastic and uh, Stephen Graham Jones really knocked it out of the park. I couldn't have been more pleased with it. I read it in a single sitting and was just blown away. I gave it a four to five stars. It was really, really good. And um, yeah, it was just so, so well done. And uh, I am looking forward to picking up any and all Stephen Graham Jones that comes out. So that's gonna happen. Anyway, guys, that's short and sweet for today. I hope that uh, you guys are all doing well. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for coming by to the corner. Bye.